In this video, we are going to talk about promotion, the fourth P in marketing. Promotion can also be understood in terms of integrated marketing communication. So what is promotion? Promotion is the coordination of all the efforts the company undertakes to aware and persuade the customers to buy products and services. Once the product is developed in accordance with the needs of the customers, it needs to be priced attractively and then it needs to be available at the point of purchase. But the customer will ask about your product in the market only when he or she is aware about it. Again, awareness or communication to the customer is not everything. It should be in such a way that customers select your product over competitor's product. Robert Lauterborn calls promotion as a communication from the perspective of the consumer. Now, it is also widely known as integrated marketing communications. Earlier, it was known only as marketing communication. As the media vehicles were few and doing promotion was simpler before 1980s. Now it has become very very complex. Today a company needs to integrate all the marketing communications activities to get the maximum reach to the target audience with minimum resources. Don Sulge referred as the father of integrated marketing communications is of the view that IMC deals with all the sources of brand and company contact that a customer or prospect has with a product or service. It takes big picture approach to planning, marketing and promotion programs and coordinating the various communication functions. It requires that a company develop a total communication strategy that recognizes how all of a firm's marketing activities, not just promotion, communicate with its customers. There are several advantages of integrated marketing communications that is also known as IMC. The biggest advantage is that it creates synergy among the various promotional tools. When the consumers are less responsive to traditional advertising, it tries to reach through different tools like digital marketing, public relations and other tools. It also tries to create interactivity in the sales and promotional messages through the usage of technology. As there have been decline in the audience size for many media, it helps to develop more efficient and effective marketing communications program. Many companies try to indulge customers in the teaser campaigns through digital medium. IMC builds the most effective platform to promote a product or service through its integrated usage of communication tools for selling soaps or selling services to a job seeker. In both the cases, the promotional requirements are different, but IMC does the job. The promotional requirements of Unilever are different from Nokri.com. In the case of Unilever, all the FMCG products are meant for mass consumption and distribution, which in turn makes Unilever depend more on television commercial than the other media vehicle. On the other hand, in the case of Nokri.com, the users can only be internet literates who can surf a website to find a job. That's why most of the communication is done to target online people through ad banners on leading websites. Here the revenue of Nokri comes from the companies who place their job requirements and from the people who have gone for premium services. Besides giving a lot of emphasis on digital marketing, it also advertises with a television campaign to attract the people associated with the companies who are using or may use their services besides their target job seekers. Now let us recap. In this video, we discussed the meaning, importance and advantages of integrated marketing communications. A company needs to integrate all the marketing communications activities to get the maximum reach to the target audience with minimum resources. It also helps to create synergy and interactivity among various tools of promotional mix that is also known as tools of IMC. Thanks.